Imagine a world where meat production doesn't involve raising and slaughtering animals. This is the promise of lab-grown meat, a revolutionary technology poised to transform our food system. Also known as cultivated meat or cellular agriculture, this innovative approach creates meat directly from animal cells, eliminating the need for traditional animal farming. Lab-grown meat is not science fiction. It's a rapidly developing field with the potential to address some of the most pressing issues facing our planet. From animal welfare concerns to environmental sustainability, the implications of this technology are far-reaching. But is this where we want to go? We'll examine the production process, the demand, the taste, and the societal resistance surrounding lab-grown meat, aiming to provide a balanced and informative perspective on this emerging food technology. Join me as we explore the potential of lab-grown meat. Will it reshape our future or create another frankenfood? But first, it helps a lot if you can share and subscribe. If you enjoyed this video and want to support the channel, consider leaving a super thanks. Your contribution helps me create more great content for you. Thank you. Now let's learn about lab-grown meat. The journey from animal cell to lab-grown meat takes place inside a controlled environment called a bioreactor. The process begins with a small sample of cells, typically muscle cells, extracted from an animal through a harmless biopsy. These cells are then placed in a nutrient-rich growth medium, providing them with the essential building blocks they need to multiply and thrive. Inside the bioreactor, the cells are carefully monitored and maintained at optimal conditions for growth including temperature, pH, and oxygen levels. As the cells multiply, they begin to form muscle fibers, the primary component of meat. The process can be tailored to produce different types of meat, such as beef, chicken, or fish, by using cells from the respective animals. As the global population continues to grow, so too does the demand for protein. Traditional animal agriculture is facing increasing pressure to meet this demand raising concerns about its environmental impact, animal welfare practices, and the sustainability of our food system. Lab-grown meat offers a potential solution to these challenges, presenting a more ethical and sustainable way to produce meat. Consumers are becoming increasingly aware of the ethical implications of their food choices, driving demand for alternatives to conventionally produced meat. Lab-grown meat aligns with these values, offering a way to enjoy the taste and nutritional benefits of meat without the ethical dilemmas associated with animal farming. Moreover, lab-grown meat has the potential to enhance food security by providing a more reliable and controlled source of protein. One of the most critical factors determining the success of lab-grown meat is its taste. Early tastings of lab-grown meat have been promising, with reports describing it as remarkably similar to conventionally produced meat. The texture and flavor are said to be comparable, although some tasters have noted subtle differences. Scientists are constantly refining the production process to improve the taste and texture of lab-grown meat, experimenting with different cell types, growth mediums, and cultivation techniques. As the technology advances, we can expect the taste and texture to become even more indistinguishable from traditional meat. Moreover, lab-grown meat offers the possibility of customization. Imagine tailoring the fat content, nutritional profile, or even the flavor of your meat to your preferences. The price of progress, economic viability, and accessibility. While lab-grown meat holds immense promise, its economic viability and accessibility remain significant hurdles. The production process is currently expensive, making it a luxury product out of reach for many consumers. However, as with any new technology, the cost of production is expected to decrease as the industry scales up and becomes more efficient. Several companies are working tirelessly to drive down costs and make lab-grown meat a competitive alternative to conventional meat. They are investing heavily in research, infrastructure, and partnerships to accelerate the development and commercialization of this technology. It has the potential to create new jobs, stimulate economic growth, and reduce the environmental and economic costs associated with traditional animal agriculture. Florida says no, global resistance and regulatory pushback. The emergence of lab-grown meat has been met with mixed reactions, ranging from enthusiastic support to cautious skepticism and outright opposition. The state of Florida, for instance, has emerged as a battleground for the future of lab-grown meat. 
In 2024, Florida became the first state in the U.S. to ban the sale of lab-grown meat, reflecting the influence of powerful agricultural lobbies and concerns about the potential disruption to traditional farming practices. Similar resistance is emerging in other parts of the world, driven by a combination of factors, including protectionism. Established agricultural industries view lab-grown meat as a threat to their livelihoods and are lobbying for regulations that hinder its development and market entry. Consumer skepticism is another factor. Some consumers remain wary of lab-grown meat, questioning its safety, naturalness, and ethical implications. These challenges highlight the need for clear communication, robust regulations, and ongoing dialogue to address concerns and ensure the responsible development and integration of lab-grown meat into our food system. Navigating the moral maze of lab-grown meat. Lab-grown meat is often seen as more ethical, but it has its own ethical concerns. One primary concern is animal welfare. Initial cell collection involves living animals, are the animals treated humanely? These questions need transparency. Another concern is the potential for unintended consequences. Long-term health effects are not fully understood. The environmental impact, while less, is not negligible. Environmental impacts, a sustainable solution or a green mirage. One of the most compelling arguments in favor of lab-grown meat is its potential to significantly reduce the environmental impact of our food system. Traditional animal agriculture is alleged to be a major contributor to greenhouse gas emissions, deforestation, water pollution, and biodiversity loss. Lab-grown meat production, on the other hand, requires far less land, water, and energy than conventional livestock farming. It eliminates the need for vast grazing pastures, reduces the production of methane and other greenhouse gases, and minimizes the risk of agricultural runoff, polluting our waterways. However, it's important to note that lab-grown meat has its own negative environmental impact. The production process still requires energy to power bioreactors, manufacture growth mediums, and maintain sterile environments. Life cycle assessments, which analyze the environmental impact of a product from cradle to grave, are crucial to accurately assess the sustainability of lab-grown meat. Further research and technological advancements will be key to minimizing its environmental footprint and realizing its full sustainability potential. The future of food. Will lab-grown meat transform our diets? The future of lab-grown meat is full of possibilities, but its ultimate success will depend on a multitude of factors, including consumer acceptance, regulatory approval, technological advancements, and economic viability. As the technology matures and production costs decrease, cultured meat is likely to become more widely available and affordable. This could lead to a gradual shift in consumer behavior, with more people incorporating lab-grown meat into their diets. However, it's unlikely that lab-created meat will completely replace traditional animal agriculture anytime soon. Consumer preferences, cultural traditions, and the economic viability of traditional farming will continue to shape our food system. Instead of a complete replacement, we are more likely to see a future where lab-grown meat coexists alongside traditional meat, plant-based alternatives, and other innovative protein sources. Meat grown in labs has the potential to play a significant role in this future, but its success will depend on our ability to navigate the complexities, address the concerns, and harness the potential of this groundbreaking technology. A call for transparency, building trust in cellular agriculture. Transparency is key as lab-grown meat moves from the lab to the marketplace. Consumers need to understand the science, ethics, and environmental impact of lab-grown meat. Clear labeling informs consumers about the origin and production of their meat. Open communication from companies is essential. Independent research and regulatory oversight ensure safety and transparency. Embracing transparency and ethical principles fosters a sustainable food system. Conclusion. Embracing innovation while addressing concerns. Lab-grown meat represents a remarkable feat of scientific innovation with the potential to transform our relationship with food and address some of the most pressing challenges facing our planet. From reducing the environmental impact of meat production to improving animal welfare and enhancing food security, the possibilities are vast. However, as with any disruptive technology, the emergence of lab-grown meat raises valid concerns and ethical considerations. 
transparency, rigorous research, ethical production practices, and robust regulations will be essential to ensure the responsible development and integration of lab-grown meat into our food system. By fostering open dialogue, addressing consumer concerns, and prioritizing sustainability, we can harness the power of this technology to create a more ethical, just, and sustainable future for food. One concern for me is whether there will be animals kept just to be cut away at for starter cells. I would want to know why they can't seed new meat with cells from the lab-grown meat. There's so many questions, but with an open mind to innovation while addressing concerns, perhaps we can unlock the potential of this technology to create a more sustainable and compassionate food system for generations to come.